Hi everyone, it's Jess here from nigeza.co.uk. Thank you for joining me. And today these two beauties go live. So it is the July to December mini catalogue and celebration. Celebration is from the 1st of July to the 31st of August. And so when you spend £45 on products, any products, so it could be from this new mini, it could be from the annual, it could be from clearance. Um, if it comes to £45, you start earning freebies. Um, and so there are two levels of freebies, so £45 and £90. So let's have a little quick little look. You might have seen some samples so we have the hippos every year there's always a little cutesy little animal um stamp set this year it is hippos if you know me you know i don't do cutesy so um you probably won't see me using this um but i have seen some samples if i had kids i probably would but i do have kids but they're adults um so there is our um hippos and that's for a 45 pounds to spend and for a further 45 pounds spend you can get some dies so you've got the three dies there that cut out the three hippos and then you can have them in a tub in a little boat on the sea wearing snorkels glasses little party hats holding an umbrella we've got a little is that a bird or a butterfly Oh no, it's it's the it's the motor for the little for the little boat. What an idiot. Um so then we've got the little um um life ring there. So yeah, I mean I did think actually I quite liked the dies just for these other little elements, not necessarily the um the hippos. So there's that. Then there's paper. I do love paper. Um, so this is called Rings of Love and it does coordinate with a stamp set in the catalogue. It tells you there on page 62. So that's just cross reference here. So page 62, there's this stamp set. And so the elements in this stamp set appear in this paper. And I quite like it because you've got Quite a lot of lovely sayings just for you, thinking of you. Happy anniversary, get well soon, love and warmth, Merry Christmas. So that's quite versatile there. Um, I was realising the other day I don't have a get well soon um, stamp that's current um, and I needed a few. And it also comes with a hybrid embossing folder. So you get an embossing folder that embosses the rings on the tree and then you get the... Uh, dies which cut out the rings outer and inner and then some bits of foliage as well so that's quite cool I do like a bit of foliage um, I will show you what I've got from celebration I haven't got lots um, yeah that's the next page Jess. so then we've got pool party and soft so foam cards and envelopes so you get 20 cards and 20 envelopes so you'll get 10 in each color i imagine um so they're always quite handy to have i think there's printing on there i'm gonna just put on my glasses let me just move that a little bit because you're getting glare aren't you um yeah there's little printing on so you've got this lovely on the inside of the envelopes is that focusing and you've got little bits of printing on there and you've got printing on the flap of the envelopes. See it better in that picture. I'm not really sure what you can see. So, yeah, they're quite cute. Then we've got this stamp set here, um, which is stylish sketches. Um, again, I don't really do animals, so that wasn't on my wish list. Then we've got this lovely silver and gold paper we've had silver and gold sort of paper like this before um so it's 24 sheets 12 of two designs so we've got dots and stripes um so you've got some in silver 
and some in gold and here's some examples of cards and you can ink them which was my first thought oh i'll get some ink on that then for a 90 pound spend you've got this stamp set here with lots of great sentiments tempted by that i was very tempted by oh, a little bit of twine just decided to get in on the act and here we have a die set a tree lot die set and that coordinates it's another 90 pound purchase and that coordinates with a stamp set trees for sale which you'll find on page 39 of the catalog do, do, do. there so it coordinates with that so the dies cut out does it cut out these trees it might do. I'm not honestly sure. Cuts out the dog, cuts out the bottom of the tree. It cuts out. I will actually be able to tell you in a minute because I've got it. So um, I will be able to tell you in a minute. I quite like the fact that it's got a caravan. Um, I have a sister and a niece. Both have a caravan, both have a dog. So I thought, yeah, they'll like that. This I love. So this wasn't available when I was doing my pre-order. It was when I initially started shopping and then because I deliberated so much about what I wanted, things go in and out, in and out and shake it all about in my basket. Uh, this went out of stock. I am not sure, because I haven't checked before I came on here, whether or not it's back in stock um, for the launch. Um, but beautiful, absolutely beautiful journal just screaming to be made into a journal so um, I definitely want this and I love these stamps and um, these will cut out beautifully I reckon on my scan and cut and there's some lovely examples there look ha look at the detail in that stamp you can see it there with that I presume it's mossy meadow just just stunning love it and then as always with celebration you get a free host stamp set for i think it's 275 pounds spend you get perfect pomegranate um if you know me i don't do fruit i would never make a card with a pomegranate on it but you know um i quite like the foliage bits love a bit of dotage so there are other elements that I would possibly use and then at the back there's always a special joining offer uh, during a celebration and this time it's the making plans collection and um, I have done a separate video on this let me just show you the beautiful journal gorgeous is that if you're into planners it's beautiful um, I have set it up, got myself a little template there for cutting more pages. Got a pocket in there, pocket in there, and then three pockets there. And turn it to the back, you've got a pocket there. So holds a pen. And yeah, it's just it's just lovely. I've said it, I've got a separate video on this. Um, there I go through setting it up. You get stickers as well and um yeah i just love it i've got six months in there um and it goes up until the end of 2023 so you've got 18 months worth of calendar sheets in there so you get that 18 months worth of sheets so you get this stamp set as well, which is brilliant for going with your planner. It's photopolymer. I haven't used it yet, as you can see, but I will be doing some planning videos, I reckon. I've watched loads. I'm addicted. Um, so I've got that. And then you also get some notebooks. So this is all on top of your £130 worth of products that you get to choose and you pay £99. That's it. No postage back in on your starter kit. So these are the three notebooks. I'd probably decorate that. Looks a bit plain. And this one, I'd probably decorate this. It does look a bit plain. This one, beautiful. So this one is plain paper. This one 
lined paper this one your dotty paper so that is the joining offer so let's have a little look at what i got in my pre-order so did i give you a little flick through the catalogue i haven't yet either um so if you've got kids you will probably love there's that one but what you'll probably love oh i thought it was sooner there we go santa's express i'm sure this is going to be very very popular i don't have it i don't have I've got great nieces and nephews that are little. Um, well, well, I've got a great, great niece that's little. My great niece is in their mid-twenties, so she won't thank me for saying she's little. Um, so, yeah, I just think this is cute. So you've got their stamp set and the dies, and you can make a little train. Quite cute. Um, so it, it's got paper and everything to go with it. So that's quite cool. The um, penguins are back. Yay. Two lovely penguin. Matching punch. If you didn't get it last year and the re catalogue retired before you had a chance to get it, you can get it now. Um, this is back. The Merriest Moments is back. I did share a card that Jill Paper Placey Crafting made last year with this set on my blog yesterday. It's stunning. Um, beautiful paper. I love poinsettias. I'm a bit of a sucker for poinsettias. Do love that paper. Haven't got it yet, but I really, really like it. I was tempted by this, but you can only get so much at a time. Uh, I will be putting another order because I want that £90 uh, bundle. This paper's back, paper painted Christmas. So I've still got some left from last year. Um, nice red barn, which I think... Um, <laughs> we, as British, think that's just so typically American. Love it. Beautiful paper. I'll show you that um, in a close-up in a minute. Um, there's Dog. I think he's very popular. Not with me, but I think he is very popular. Seal. I'm just honest. I just don't do. I just don't do animals at all. And um, there's a Yeti. Yeah. We'll move on. There we go. Um, that's that tree set. Um, beautiful paper. I'll be showing you that in a moment. Gnomes, they're, they're proving very popular amongst demos. Um, yeah. Moose, snowman, not the cutest snowman. I was quite disappointed by that snowman. I have to say, stamping up, I have to say, this paper's stunning. I will show you that. Uh, flick, flick, flick. Yeah, we don't do Thanksgiving. Well, actually, that's a lie. I had my first Thanksgiving uh, dinner last year because my son's boyfriend's American. And um, hopefully we'll be able to repeat that. It was a lovely, lovely time. Uh, cutesy witches. We don't do Halloween in quite the same way in the UK as they do in America and Canada. But um, yeah, I did quite like them. I'm doing a Harry Potter journal. Was quite tempted for the sorting hat. But, yeah, how many times am I going to put the sorting hat in my journal? Mm. This, cute, cute. We do love a box. We do love the um, having a die that makes a box. Very easy. Favours. Advent calendar, Christmas, Halloween, Easter. Just wonderful. Wedding favours. Brilliant. You've got lots and lots of elements there and you got numbers so the numbers you can cut the number out or you can cut it in a circle with it punched out if you get what i mean um so that's fab I've shown you that another set to go with the bottle so if you bought the bottle set in the annual catalogue and you've got the bottle punch there's another set there that you can use um pretty pretty paper uh I did love the typewriter. I'm not quite sure I'd make a card with a cardi on it, to be fair. Um, I like a bit of mittens. I like some hearts. That's another little, um, it's like a folded tag die. Quite cute. Quite love this. I've shown this before. This I have used in a couple of videos recently. Love, 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 love. That's all I can say, really. 
brilliant makes tags makes lovely little toppers like that love it and the oh i've not seen that it was another way of using it brilliant and that's it so there's there's all the bundles that you save on if you buy a bundle you get 10 percent off so shall we do some paper there we go paper so this is rustic harvest okay now i usually share with my mate chill we saw each other last weekend so we did our little swapsies of what we're sharing she won't convince with this paper um because like i don't think either of us would use that but on the reverse side of every sheet it's black and white so she was like oh yeah i can use that so two sides to each sheet don't like one you probably like the other um Yellow's not really my colour, but I actually quite like that. And I can see me using that maybe in a vintage journal. A little bit of inking on that. It would look nice. And um, and there we have a lovely black and white leafy acorn like that. This was the cellar. This was like, got to have this piece, babe. It's just beautiful. And there you've got six cards easily, six notebook fronts, even... A panel for the front of a journal absolutely stunning love that sheet love it love it love it nice little um pattern on the back as well here we go load of veg great if you're doing um um little treats for um thanksgiving cut these out fussy cut them out I'm not I think I could possibly cut these out on my scan and cut. I would certainly give it a try. And then on the other side, you've got this black and white. I did last year, I think I sort of sprinkled the table with bits of bits of pumpkins and things. Um, Cajun craze, a colour I like. A lot of people are a bit, you know, mm, I'm not really sure about Cajun craze. I like it, don't use it enough. And love that. Love, love, love that. And um I would attempt to have that cut out of my scan and cut. And then Mossy Meadow, my favourite green. Love this sheet. It's just gorgeous. And I love that as well. So that is that paper. Rustic Harvest. It's very nice. Um, so there we go. That's the punch. So you make tags out of this. I have shown it already. Um, I'm sure I've got a sample of how I've done it. Here we go. Let me just trim this. So you're making a tag. I do use credit cards that are already cut up. So there we go. Let's do a two and three quarter inch tag. And we want to do a slanty, the slanty top. That you get in tags one two slanty top done you want the little bit in the middle you've got a little line there centers done tag brilliant love it so that works a treat let's get a little square bit so let me go through here. Let's do three inch square. Three by three. Stamp your sentiment for the top of a card. Let's make it look pretty. One, we have to turn it over. Two, three, turn it over. Four. How's that for fabulous? I've done it wrong. <laughs> that's correct. And that's correct. Need a little bit more of a thought there because that didn't work. I wonder if I can correct it. I probably can't. No. Let me trim that bit off. Right, you need a bit more thought about it. So you want that to match. That's going to match that way. There we go. So we want that to match. There 
there. There we go. Got there in the end. How fab's that? Nice little tag. Make it any size you want. And that is nice for putting sentiment on the top of a card. And you could slot a little bit of ribbon in that. So stick that up there. So it's centred. I think I'd be inclined to measure if I was doing this. There you go. You can slot a bit of ribbon through it. Got yourself a nice little tag. Super duper. Love it. Favourite thing in the catalogue. That and 12 by 12 black cardstock. Right. Uh, more paper. Let's do more paper. This is Lights of Glow. Lights of Glow paper. So 12 by 12 paper comes in um 12 sheets or six by six 48 sheets if half this with jill you get four of each sheet so we've got some nice gold um foiling and then plain on the other side love it so this one how gorgeous love it beautiful beautiful and then lovely stars on the other side that's kind of like trees love it these we've got four four little card toppers there or you can make four little mini cards love 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 this die cut this with your frame dies i think the stitch stylish stitch frames go with it now love it there we've got a nice little stripey bit there with gold in it and on the other side we have these stars how stunning is that? And then you've got those stars on the other side. Do like this. Very, very pretty. And then plain on the other side. This, there's dies that, that are in the set. I think they cut these trees out, which is quite pretty. Well, I think maybe. Maybe I'm wrong. But that's cute. Then we've got... I love that. Love, love, love it. That on the other side. And then we've got some little gold stars there. And on the other side, we've got these. They're like boho dots or boken dots. I think we had some, we had a stamp that did that a couple of years ago. That's got gold on it. And then we've got that on the other side. And then we've got um, the same of those mini cards. The colours in it. Ah, oh, basic black, cherry cobbler, evening evergreen, soft succulent and very vanilla. Do love it. I think cherry cobbler is one of my favourite Christmas reds. And uh, evening evergreen is perfect Christmas red. I like shaded spruce as well for a Christmas red. So that is lights, lights aglow. I am afraid that my mountain there is going to fall down. Right, some more sharesy with Jill. So there is this amazing vellum. Let me just do these, get those two out for the moment. So we've got this amazing vellum in the catalogue. It's called Snowflake Speciality Vellum. So you get one sheet, one 12 by 12 sheet of each design. Obviously, Jill and I have shared them. So we just got a 12 by 6. So that's got like flocked um, dots, a bit like snowflakes. And so you've got a flocked version and then you've got like a holographic foil version. Beautiful. Of each style. So that's that one. Then we've got snowflakes. How cool are they? And then we've got the holographic foil version of those snowflakes. And then we've got more snowflakes, but they are a different design. Cool. Absolutely wonderful. And one thing that I wanted to check, so if I now bring in my joyful flurry bundle 
so you get this stamp set and the matching dies. I weren't sure if these are the outline dies. I weren't sure if they cut any of these out. Are they the same shape by any shape of the imagination? Not really. Not really, Jez. I don't think they do. It was just a thought when we opened it. But I wondered if we could die cut these out. Well, actually, you could die cut them out. That would be quite cute. So that would die cut it out, I think. Might look nice. Might not. But, yeah. That was just some thoughts there. So loving that paper there's this beautiful ribbon absolutely stunning so it's a bit like the open weave ribbon we've got in the in colors but it's it's this nice sort of creamy color with a bit of gold in it love it absolutely love it and then there's these pearls so we've got gold silver i think that's soft succulent is it and then a red i don't know if it's cherry cobbler i'd have to look it up in the catalog to see what colors they are so yes that's my bundle there of i have to have snowflakes i can't possibly make christmas cards without including snowflakes it is a red rubber stamp um lights and dots different sized snowflakes let it snow. I always quite like I love that little happy Christmas. I said to Jill, my favourite stamp is the little happy Christmas. She went, yeah, it is mine. <laughs> Joyful wishes. It is the season of magic and wonder. Now, I'd use magic and wonder if um, making a journal just like that. Um, send you all the best this new year. Cool. So then we have these cut out. All the images. There, there and there. And the little one. And then you've got images on their own. Well, you know, elements. And then on the back, we've got these as well. So it cuts out um, snowflakes. These, I believe, are leave-in. I haven't tried them out yet. But I think you cut it out and they stay in. So that's quite cool. And some stitch labels bonus love it so uh, I do love me stitch effects so they'll go nice with all the other stitchy things that I have got um, did I show you this I said things were going to go for a button so this is spruced up this is a photopolymer stamp set as you can see I have used those two stamps, the only two stamps I have used. So we can we can stamp baubles, round ones, nice elongated ones. You've got the the top to put on the baubles. You've got candy canes. You've got snowflakes and stars. Not quite sure what that's for. Somebody may enlighten me. Maybe you put it across a big bauble. Really don't know. I'll have to I'll have to investigate. Think about it. A couple of trees and some presents and then you've got the dies that cut them out and what these do is it cuts out a, an outline as well as a solid middle in all of them there can you see they've got double edged so you get an outline in the middle uh, a solid one in the middle and then an outline around the outside it's quite cute got a video on my youtube channel at six o'clock tonight um using this set um i do like that little sort of like lights um we cut out the candy cane uh we cut out the stars we cut out that so you can stamp that in a different color you can emboss it in silver cut it straight out in silver nice little stars snowflake different shape baubles i like the fact that they've included that shape got a christmas got a present there could be for any 
any occasion it doesn't have to be for christmas okay what else have we got so there is the christmas tree one trees for sale and that's the celebration um die set that goes with it this is a photopolymer set so you light up the season so very merry christmas greetings trees for sale quite cute i thought scrapbooking great one for scrapbooking a christmas scene uh so i wanted to see if it cuts stamped him oh it does thought it did so that will cut out the three trees perfect those three trees can be cut out fab cuts out the dog uh, cuts out the trees for sale sign cuts out the bottom of the tree you've got three of them help you you've got a little skirt thing there um, cuts out these so you can do a string of lights and you've got bunting love a bit of bunting um, we've got a little christmas wreath there that's cool to put on the caravan door and then we've got a caravan you've got some extra bits to change the color up on your caravan how cool you've even got whatever that is don't know don't know until i start using it um what it might be so yeah quite like that free 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 oh let's put the trees back so yeah spend 90 quid this is yours for free so had to get the stamp set and i love the fact that it cuts out these trees as well which really nice detail there can't wait to get creating with this might do that a little bit later today i've got a celebration vlog hop and video coming out tomorrow i haven't decided yet what i'm using maybe it will be that oh there i did have a little play with that with that um i knew i had some samples somewhere so there's a tag using the fancy top so you get a nice fancy top there that's the straight one and there is my little tag see i did that one right and um oh i just cut those extra to do some more but i didn't so celebration paper so this is the silver and gold paper i'm not even sure if i've opened this packet so we've got so it's plain on the back so four sheets there no six sheets gold stripe presumably six sheets of the dot now nice little snow scene use me christmas dies cut out the gold christmas tree that will look fab. And then we've got silver stripes and silver dots. So there we go. 6, 6, 12, 12, 12, 24, 24 all together. They will take ink as well. So you can colour them. Cute make little treats as well out of them it's quite nice thickness it's not too thick it's just lovely i won't put that back let's just create my pile to the side i think this is the last thing i'm showing you in it yeah so this is the last thing i've got to show you that celebration um paper it's called rings of love 12 sheets two of each design so we have this lovely lovely florals and then on the other side we have a bit of check going on so that's cool some very autumnal um design there that's cool and that's beautiful i did think 
There might be a journal coming on with this. I do love it. <gasps> and I just think that is definitely going in a journal. That is just beautiful. All those little birdies. I'm not about to tell you what I think they might be. The blue tits? Don't know. Lovely. And on the, on the other side. <gasps> love. Love, love, love. Just stunning. Then we've got these little houses. If I was making a new home card, that might be useful, but wait for it. Oh, how gorgeous is that? Just love that. That is probably the side I'm going to use. It's just gorge. Love, love, love it and goes so nicely with that page. How cool would they be together? Very cool is the answer. Uh, then we've got a bit of toast odds. Nice little, I, I could cut them out. My scan and cut. I think cut that out, no problem whatsoever. And then I've got nice little elements for my journals. Do like them, I can see them in little clusters. On tags. What's the other side like? Yeah. And then we've got those rings. I imagine, I don't know, but the die from the from the uh, set in the catalogue. Probably cut those out. Possibly we'll emboss them as well to make them look more realistic. Um, is that the more? Oh no. And then there's Pontiata. So there we go. It could be a poinsettia, it could be anything really. Very nice. Bit of floral going on there. And oh, I do like that. Nice little bit of a foresty background. That's quite cool. So that is that dude's piece. That's that's everything. That's everything that I got in it. It is everything that I got. I did recently get it's not from this catalogue, but I recently got the hues of happiness. So I got that, I got the dies, I got the stamp set. I got the whole blooming sweet, didn't I? And I got the gems. We go with it. That's the whole suite. Love it. I've already used this video coming out later today. One of the do you know the main reason why I wanted this? I wanted these two dies here. To make it look like a torn notebook and that just like a slotted notebook. Love it. That's what I wanted that for. Quite nice set. The paper's stunning. Absolutely stunning. Um, I mean, this is all over the internet. People have been making this. These scan and cut, cut that out. Other side, just beautiful. Love these coloured sides and then you've got an array of a rainbow of florals that's lovely as well oh, how nice is that this sheet very beautiful that on the other and then there's two other sheets i was playing with my scan oh no i've showed you that it's that sheet Is that all of them? One, two, three, four, five. There's one missing. What have I missed out? The other one I cut out. That one. No, it's only that one. Have I missed a sheet? No, I haven't. So there's two like this in two different colours. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so that's the colours. And what I did yesterday, can I see them way over here, was I used my scan and cut and I got this lot. 
already all ready to put on cards. The dies cut them out. You do get dies. You can cut them out without a scan and cut, but this was much quicker. So got loads, loads of loads of those. And then I cut out the other sheet as well. Got these already. I did some with a border, some without. Just love them. Sometimes I want a border, sometimes I don't. So I kind of mixed and matched. So I do like half a sheet with a border and half a sheet without. There we go. So can't wait to be using those in projects. So that's it. That is my haul. Gosh, that took a long time. I've been over 40 minutes. I do apologise. Um, and um, yeah, oh, I did, yeah, these shiny dots. They're quite cute. Do love the purple. So, yeah. Um, I'm a, I'll link down below to my shop if you want to go and purchase anything. Every £45 you spend, you title to something free. Don't forget to use my host code. I send you a thank you card and a little thank you gift if you use my host code. If you don't use my host code, it's just a card. Um, oh, and I might make a little something I, I usually make a little something as well to go with um yeah and um if you like the planner then um, why not join my team okay so see you all later today for a video using some of the new products okay bye for now